welcome back to my channel so i'm gonna vlog today or i'm gonna try to um so the itinerary for today is right now i'm gonna get some chicken wings it's probably not even noon yet it's probably like 11 something hold on with my camera i mean with my car oh it's noon it's 12 on the dot right now so i'm gonna get some chicken wings and then i'm going to my old job to um go to like this back to school drive at three and then <coughs> oof, I'm hungry and then I'm going to and these these like biker shorts they be just clenching my stomach like I see why you look like a skinny a slim thick queen when you wear them but that's the size point anyway so I'm doing that at three then I um the part that y'all probably will actually see is I'm going to go shop for like um, room decorations and stuff for my room next year. Two of two of the things that I already had in my room, I'm keeping. Um, I'm keeping my um my two pictures. Like once it says like makeup makes everything better, and the other one says like wake up and makeup, and they're both in pretty good condition still, and they like they never failed. Like the whole time I was living there, they never fell off the wall. So I'm gonna probably keep those, but I need to get like some other stuff to decorate my room so probably gonna go to five below or five and below i don't know how you, how you would say it so yeah that's all that's happening today i'm all ready to give me a 10 piece honey hot not a combo though actually i might get the combo because combo's on like a couple dollars more so i actually might get the combo um should i go around this trash truck we're doing it everything is in shambles it's like i just brought everything i just moved out of an apartment and now it's a pack to like move into the next one in within a week now because i've already been home for a week so i have a whole another week now um so i'm stressed and then i just got in my car today for like the first time in like a week and i realized i never even took all the stuff out of my car from when i moved out so there's like pots and pans in here tupperware board games and iron a wendy's bag like and i don't like to i don't like to move in unless my car is clean so like I don't want to start packing my car up. I don't want to pack a dirty car is what I'm trying to say. So I eventually have to take all this stuff out, go get my car cleaned and then repack it. It's annoying. I don't have anything else to do all day. So I don't know why I'm so stressed. Cause it's not like I just have like so much to do for like, you know, all day. I have nothing to do, but still it's like, I just don't feel like it. So yeah, anyways. All of that was longer drawn out to say that I'm vlogging today, so you guys are coming along for a shopping trip. Yay! Okay, <clears throat> so I'm gonna teach y'all how to eat a chicken wing. I already tore a little piece of the side off of this flats, flats only. And so, if you can see the, let's just piece of hair on my finger. Just remove that to the side. If you can see that's that's the bone right there. We're just gonna take that bone. We're just gonna wiggle it out. There's a little bit of meat on it. Oh, you got meat off of that. And then boom. We got one bone on meat. So from that point, you just wanna slide that meat off the bone. Dip that thing in some ranch. I'm <laughs> sorry, <laughs> And that's what you're me. I y'all got one more left, so I can show y'all again. Okay. My last chicken wing, I have to make a count. Get a sip of water. Okay. <clears throat> so, take a little bit of the corner off. I'm going to start. You want to get into that bone. Take that bone out of that thing. I'm get some of it. I'm going to it out. Call me on. Get that meat off of there. And then you just got bone and meat. Me. I just want to get 
the most out of your chicken wings. If you ain't getting all flat, you're wasting your money. Um, so yeah. Thanks for watching my chicken wing tutorial. I'll see you guys in the next video. I'm gonna take my horse to the hotel. <laughs> My bad. Yeah, I got some in them. Do they have a K? You got a J, you got a C. Yes, we have a K. How do you hang these? Like, what do you what do you hang these bed Like a like a hook? Yeah. Like in the ceiling. Like you're going to really in the ceiling for that. That's the ceiling that just fall on your face. <laughs> Alright, I'm not gonna get that. <laughs> Put that up there with a little stick on hook. <laughs> these storage cubes. I want one of, I want some of these. I actually want three of these. Yeah, because three is an even number. I mean, it's not an even number. <laughs> okay. Um. <laughs> three is not an even number, but. <laughs> okay. Be the change you want to see in the world is five dollars. Look up more is four dollars. So, I think I'm gonna look up more. Canvas wall art, that's cute. It's not even a thing in my room, I don't know about it. Should I? Or maybe, oh, this one's better. Keep it red, that's more my thing. This is going outside the door, so it doesn't matter. Is this like a, does this work? Is this a real lamp? Because I want a little lamp. It's a lamp. It's a better Okay, I'm gonna get a black one of those. I'm trying to spend $50 or less. No more than $75, definitely. Okay, I'm not in the right section anymore. Let me turn around. Oh, Alright, you can go. There's like way too many people in here. Mm. I'm usually, I usually buy the big bag. That's not big? Yeah, the, the big bag. Those. Um, that's whole $5 though. Let's just get another one. Okay. Little ones. We got Ross. And Marshall. Are you recording? Yes. Baby, okay, I ain't stopping either, baby. I'm not afraid. <laughs> I'm not afraid of uh, a lawsuit. But it says style your space, but all I see is bed spreads. Somebody's lying. Y'all, this this exact trash can is eighteen dollars on Amazon. On uh, what? On Amazon, this exact trash can is like eighteen dollars. I need something that closes because I don't like people looking at my trash. It will not be smart for me to spend fifty dollars on a mirror. I want a big one. Wow. I can't do it. I can't spend that much on a mirror. I want a mirror. This would be cool How much are they? I want a, a big mirror so bad, but $50 is 
just it's not, just it's not really. Well, I need a shower curtain. This is cute. I'm all for it. I like it. Um, I need a buggy. Okay, I'm gonna stop the video right here because it's hindering my shopping. Um, but y'all gonna get a haul. Y'all, I was supposed to finish this video so long ago, but literally I can't get the privacy needed to record a video. I'm not the type that records videos in front of people. I need my own space, own time, all of that. So I'm coming back to finish this video. And show y'all what I actually got at Five Below, TJ, Five Below, Ross, and Marshall's is where I went. Yeah, so I'm gonna show y'all what I got. So this right here was probably the most expensive like one item I got. And it was like $17 and I got it from Marshall's. $16.99 and I think she cute hair goals I'm trying to get my hair right before I graduate because I want to wear my real hair in my graduation pictures but I really like this picture so yeah I got two of these bins from five below they were five dollars each collapsible storage bins and I thought about it I was like if people come in my room they can sit on them um because I probably don't have much seating in my room so you know if you need place six so I'm in so yeah then I got this five dollars it says keep it rad it's like three pictures in one I only got it because it matched my room I don't care nothing about keeping it rad but it matches my room so it's cute um then I got this it was four dollars which is a little expensive for this if you ask me but it just goes on the outside of my door oh it says a wall jewelry organizer um, I'm just gonna put it on my door because I don't need all that I just wanted a K for my door can I just have that so yeah I didn't even notice I had this hook at the bottom I wonder if I can take that off it has screws I'm sure I can but it'll probably all fall apart four dollars going outside my door so yeah I think I saw y'all saw when I picked this up and I said this was nine dollars and it's literally like sixteen dollars something like that on Amazon it's something astronomical um so yeah I got this from Ross and I got it for nine dollars and I wanted the trash can that closed because ladies you know when your period come on and you got like tampon wrappers and pads and stuff in the trash can people want to go use your bathroom and you got tampons and pads taking out the trash can and that is just annoying and I just be like oh you really gotta use my bathroom so yeah now I have something that closes so you can use my bathroom now um, this is probably the purchase that I regret because it didn't even come with hooks. Um, but it's a shower curtain and it was $8. I feel like $8 is expensive not to come with hooks. And I got it from Ross. I didn't notice it didn't come with hooks so I left the store because if I would have noticed, I would not have bought it. But I already bought it and I'm not going to take it back. It's cute. But I just get the hooks. I also got this lamp from Five Below. I want to say it was $5. Um... And it's cute, it's little. I have a lamp, but it just doesn't fit my aesthetic anymore. Um, and this is small and cute, and I can put it in front of me to do my makeup, and just, it's, like, it's so little. And it'll provide all the light I need, so yeah. Really love this lamp. I also got this sponge holder, um, because, I mean, if you clean your shower, I don't know what you might clean it with, but I clean mine with a sponge, and I don't like to just sit it in my shower. And this has a suction on it, so you can suction it against it. It was $3.99. I might be expensive for a sponge holder, but I feel like it'll be very useful for me um, to put my sponge in. And then when I change my charger, I put the sponge in. So yeah, I really wanted this. Like, this is like, I picked it up, I was like, I have to buy it. Um, and I got this from Marshalls. Um, okay, and then I did get a few school supplies the other day. I did not vlog that. I had an attitude that day, so I did not vlog it. But I'll show y'all what I got. Um, I got some pins. I don't even be using pins. I don't know why I buy pins every year. Like, I'm going to just use them this year. But we're going to try. Um, I got metallic markers. Okay, I'll take all my notes are taken in metallic markers. If I had a notebook, I would show y'all. But literally, all my notes are taken in metallic marker. Like, I don't write everything in the metallic marker. But, like, my headings and all of that are written in metallic marker. Because I have a really hard time paying attention in class. But these markers smell super duper strong. And I really like them. So, I like that smell. So, as long as I'm writing with the marker, I can smell it. And so, that gives me an incentive to pay attention and take notes. So, yeah um then i got this big thing of pencils i really wasn't gonna get this many pencils because i don't think i need it but my mom was like you never run out of pencils but i usually don't run out of pencils so but anyways anybody need to borrow a pencil i got one the last thing i got was this five subject notebook i probably could have got a three subject notebook but 
I got a five subject one so yeah um I'll be taking my notes for every single class in this notebook um because that's that's just how I do I told y'all that last year that's how I do that's what's working for me so yeah that's what I'm doing um and my GPA has greatly improved since I've been doing this like when I first started college and I was just I was just not, I just didn't know what I was doing. Like I just had so many binders. I used to bring the wrong binder to class. I used to just, it was just a mess. Like I just was like, oh my gosh, I just can't get it together. But less is more. One notebook, all your notes, put a date on them, title them, and you will know where they at and it won't confuse you. People think I'm like wild for writing all my notes in the same notebook, no spaces, no nothing. But let me tell you, I ain't never got to worry about forgetting nothing at home because it's all there baby it's all there so yeah so yeah that was my whole haul for the room stuff i spent like a little under 60 i think or maybe a little maybe 60 exactly but i think a little under 60 um and then for the school supplies i don't know i didn't i didn't buy that so yeah um i really hope you guys enjoyed this video and i'm so sorry that i took forever in a day to finish it but i hope y'all enjoyed the vlog make sure to like comment and subscribe and i'll see y'all in the next one bye